Matterport Pro 3 3D Camera Review The Matterport Pro 3 proved to be highly user-friendly and produced very satisfactory results in our tests. It is suitable both for experienced 3D imaging users and those starting out. And we regard it as an almost ideal choice for anyone requiring this type of image. Our first impressions of this camera were positive. Its minimal and clean design was exactly as expected for its purpose. The case provided some scratch protection, but not much in terms of drop protection. It is premium built, offering surprising weight for its size. We tested this camera in a larger facility local to one of our expert editors. The building provided a range of settings with which to evaluate its abilities. Such as stairs, windows, doors, different floor levels, and open and closed spaces. We began by setting up the tripod and attaching the camera mount to it. We removed the camera from its case, inserted a full battery, and secured it onto the mount. We powered on the device with a single press and hold of the button at its back end, furthest from the lens. Subsequently, we connected a mobile device to its Wi-Fi signal via the Matterport companion app. There were several options available for the photos we wished to capture, from full scans to 360 degrees images. We activated the scan feature and stepped away from the camera as it moved around on its tripod stand. We would usually move around in a circle behind it, but if the chance arose, we would pick a spot to conceal ourselves such as behind walls or in a different room. Each rotation took less than 10 to 15 seconds to complete. The companion app would prompt us when it was time to take the next shot. Initially, we took 3 paces between each shot and then increased that to 5 paces. We observed greater image quality when giving 3 paces of space versus 5. Despite this, the photos looked impressive overall. In the companion app, we visualized a rough outline of our surroundings. We observed depth drop-offs in unexplored hallways, areas beyond our previous boundary, and reflections windows. We spent 90 minutes imagining what we wanted for this test. The app provided almost instant feedback while the 3D image rendering and processing of the final product required several hours. According to Matterport, 200 photos could have taken up to 48 hours to render and process. We only had 50 photos so it only needed roughly 6 to 8 hours. After completing the imaging process on the app, we were prompted to mark and identify windows, mirrors, and exterior trim. Additionally, there is an option to obscure any license plates, faces, or other sensitive information that may have been included in the photos. This camera provides a great balance in the 3D imaging field. It is easy to use, even for those with minimal photography or 3D imaging knowledge as long as they are able to understand digital instructions. The imaging quality was impressive, with many details in a relatively large area covered efficiently, resulting in detailed images of the testing area. This technology could be useful for many different scenarios and is tailored for spaces where virtual walkthroughs or demonstrations are required. Google Maps also supports the use of 3D images walkthroughs to illustrate buildings, meaning that virtually any business can benefit from this feature.